Hi, I'm Natasha Johnson. I'm going to talk about human rights in the UN. So I'm going to start with, what are human rights? A right that is believed to belong justly to every person. Human rights are rights inherited to all human beings, regardless of race, sex, naturality, illicity, language, religion, or any other status. Some rights that you have are, for example, right to life and liberty, freedom from slavery, and torture, and many more. UN has been promoting human rights since 1941. 45 is one of the fundamental goals for the UN to promote. One example of a right you have is freedom of opinion and expression. A violation of a human right, for example, could be not being able to go to school or work because of your gender. So what is the main laws that the UN has for human rights? Well, they created the International Bill of Rights to deal with human rights. The International Bill of Rights is made of three parts. Universal Declaration of Human Rights, created in 1948. International Covenant on Economical, Social, and Cultural Rights. International Covenant of Civil and Political Rights, all together make an International Bill of Rights. How does the UN assist with human rights? UN has many ways to assist with human rights, but we're going to look at General Assembly only. General Assembly assists human rights with three ways. Treatings, Human Rights Council, and Special Procedures. There are 80 treatings that the UN created. And one of the treatings, for example, is Declaration of Rights of Disabled Persons. Human Rights Council, their task is they have to do is strengthen promotion and protection of human rights around the globe by dealing with human rights violations and make recommendations on them. They all, also, they respond to human rights emergencies they also work with special procedures. Special procedures examine, monitor, advise, and publicly report on human rights situations in specific countries or territories or major human rights violations worldwide, like, for example, execution, torture, child prosecution, and many more. So what are the challenges the UN faces while dealing with human rights? The two main ones is religion and cultures. The challenge with religions is that most religions are built upon their own codes of right or wrong. And many religious beliefs relate to human rights, or their expression of role and status of individual society. These expressions and beliefs are not always perfectly consistent with the UN scheme of human rights, one that is strongly based on Western philosophy. For this reason, some state governments resist the application of certain human rights to extend the conflict with pre-existing religion and culture norms. Other challenge the UN has to face while doing human rights is cultures. Not all cultures believe in Western philosophy of human rights. And that's the end of my video. Thanks.